Ukrainian forces are continuing their counteroffensive by advancing south of Robotyne and Verbov, and the legendary Azov Brigade break through Russian defenses. Footage verified by the Institute for the Study of War and posted on Tuesday shows Russian forces striking Ukrainian positions northwest and west of Robotyne, indicating that Ukrainian forces have advanced into an area that Russian forces previously claimed to control. Additional geolocated images posted on Telegram on Tuesday show that Ukrainian armed forces have advanced south of Robotyne and northwest of Verbov, which is about six miles east of Robotyne. Evidence also suggests that Ukrainian forces northwest of Verbov are advancing along the line of Russian fortifications that runs into the town. Communications officials of the Ukrainian forces confirmed that they have been successful in the robotyne Novoprokopivka area south of Orakiv, and further reported that Ukrainian forces are continuing to push southward from Bakhmut. The German government announced a new round of military aid to Ukraine on Tuesday, amounting to $5.8 billion for 2023, as compared to about $2.15 billion for 2022, and additional commitments in the following years amounting to $11.3 billion. This latest package includes more than 10,000 shells for Gepard self-propelled anti-aircraft guns, a beaver armored bridge paver, four border protection vehicles, 20,000 protective goggles, 32 Zetros trucks, four 8x8 HX-81 tractors, and perhaps most importantly, about 9 million rounds of ammunition, including almost 27,000 rounds of 40 millimeter shells. Romanian President Klaus Iohannis said Tuesday that attacks in Ukraine happened very, very close to its border, with Russia repeatedly launching drone strikes on Danube infrastructure in southern Ukraine. We had attacks, which were verified at 800 meters from our border. So very, very close, Iohannis told a press conference. There was no drone and no other part of any device that made it into Romania, Iohannis said again denying earlier reports from Kiev that drone attacks transgressed Ukraine's southwestern border during Russia's strike on the Ukrainian port of Ismail. But yes, we are concerned because these attacks are taking place within a very short distance from the Romanian border, he said. We are on alert. Romania is NATO member, by the way. Russian military bloggers are saying that Ukrainian forces have increased the tempo of the counteroffensive along the Donetsk-Zaporizhia regional border on Tuesday, ISW reports. The bloggers said that the Ukraine has conducted small-scale armored assaults against positions of the Russian 37th Motorized Rifle Brigade and the 40th Naval Infantry Brigade, which is a part of the Russian Pacific Fleet in particular, resulting in modest advances. Russian battalion commander Alexander Khodakovsky posted on Telegram that Ukrainian forces have captured unspecified Russian positions in the area. And he also ceded that heavy Ukrainian artillery fire southeast of Velika Novosilka is degrading Russian morale and reducing the pace at which their troops are able to lay more mines. In addition to the psychological impact it has had on the fighters, the continuity of shelling has made it impossible for us to lay mines and replace those that have been destroyed. Kotakovsky posted. A promotional video from the Azov Assault Brigade and its highly regarded commander, Lieutenant Colonel Denis Redis Prokopenko, presents a montage of Ukrainian platoons breaking through Russian defenses in the south.
стал браться. Another sensational video appears to show how local residents deal with those who collaborate with Russian occupying forces. It claims to document how vigilantes in the Kherson area slashed a Russian flagged sport wagon's tires and applied a cosmetic makeover of the sympathizer's vehicle as retribution. And let's see more of that amazing Azov action. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe. Also, if you want to support Warthog Defense, please become our member and get early access to new videos, exclusive members only videos, and become administrator in comment section. The membership link is in the description. Rescues. Every day we had a guy last week at six rescues in six days. You know, he's doing the job every day.